Hello and welcome to this edition of Tips and Tricks. Now today I'll be talking about a subtle difference in technique and how that might sometimes put more fish in the boat. Now this comes from the experience I just had in a recent Delta Coangler tournament at the FLW. Uh, I was fishing with a pro. I ended up having a limit in culling before he even had a limit. I'm fishing behind him. He was fishing a Senko, I was fishing a Yumdinger. Very similar type baits. Colors were very similar. Uh, that wasn't really the difference because sometimes I actually put on the color he was actually fishing and still caught more fish behind him. The subtle difference was I had a Texas rig with a 5 watt Gamatsu. He had it wacky rig. I don't know if you've ever been to the California Delta, but 99% of the people you see throwing any sort of stick bait, they're throwing it wacky. So I decided, going into it, if I'm going to fish it, I've had success. I love fishing in here, Texas. I'm going to fish in Texas. Well, what happened was I caught more fish behind him. And that was the only difference. I mean, five inch, six inch, very similar uh, color. Uh, even sometimes I had the same color as him. I still caught him behind. I was actually using 12 pound mono. He was using 14 pound uh, fluoro which means his line was actually probably thinner than mine. So I don't think the, I think the only factor was the subtle difference in technique. And it's, it's something that you have to think about, especially if you're co-angler and you're fishing behind someone, don't just suddenly go completely away from what that person's fishing. Just give it a subtle difference in technique. I mean, it worked for me. Uh, I was sort of amazed that I was doing so well behind him. But I'm pretty sure that was the only difference. Texas rigged and, and the way I'm working it gives it a totally different look than when you're working it wacky. Uh, so give it a try. If you hear about a certain bite and suddenly you're struggling with it, don't go completely away from it. Just try a subtle difference in it. A little bit lighter weight, a little bit different color, a little bit smaller, a little bit bigger, wider wobble, thinner wobble, wobble on, you know, bigger blades, smaller blades. Uh, whatever the bait is, just try a slightly subtle different technique and you might find yourself putting a lot of fish in the boat when somebody else is struggling to put fish in the boat. Give it a try and I hope you have as much success on it as I did. I hope this helps. Until next time.